Hello everyone, it's Nick and we are back with another video. Today we have already passed KYC. We have done the two-factor authentication and I will be showing you how the wallet system works and how you can start earning money on Amir Capital. So first and foremost, you want to purchase crypto, either USDT, Ethereum or BTC on an exchange. Now, I'm not going to go into detail on that because whoever showed you um, uh, Amir Capital will most probably know what's the best way for you to put your funds into the platform, which exchange to use, how to buy crypto. Um, if you have any questions to me directly, I will gladly answer them and help you personally, um, which is fine. The reason for this is that in every country, it's different. For example, in Russia, one of the best platforms to use is Binance. In the UAE, since it's the Middle East region, rules are a little bit different. Uh, people use BitOasis. You can access all of these on my site. So for example, uh, if you're in Europe or Russia or the UK, Binance is fantastic for you guys. If you're in the Middle East region, uh, you know, uh, Qatar, Kuwait, UAE, Saudi, you can use BitOasis. Um, it's the only accepted crypto exchange, legally accepted crypto exchange, I believe. Uh, perhaps not just the only one, but for Middle East specifically. So once you have purchased your crypto, you can start putting your funds into Amir Capital. Now, in Amir Capital, we have three wallets. We have Bitcoin, Ethereum, and USDT, as I mentioned before. Uh, to transfer transfer Bitcoin to your Bitcoin account, Bitcoin wallet on Amir Capital, uh, you will need this address. This is the address of your wallet for Bitcoin specifically. So in whatever exchange that you have purchased Bitcoin, uh, you will withdraw to this specific address. Now, if you've purchased Ethereum, you will be withdrawing to this address, right? So for Ethereum, it's separate. It uses ERC-20 blockchain. And on BTC, you're using the Omnia blockchain. Now, USDT doesn't have its own blockchain system. So it uses, uh, for, for a mere capital platform, it uses the Ethereum blockchain, which is it's ERC-20. So on your exchange, make sure that you are withdrawing to, uh, to USDT to through the ERC-20 uh, blockchain. You can also withdraw through a TRC, but this is for more advanced users. Uh, just make sure this is ticked off and you click the address right here uh, to which you will send money. Once you have received uh, funds, it should take a couple of minutes usually, maybe maximum 10-15 minutes, you will receive the money into these wallets. Now in the wallets, it is extremely flexible. Your funds are extremely flexible. You can uh, purchase, if you've transferred USDT here, you can purchase Ethereum. If you've purchased Ethereum, you can transfer it to Bitcoin and use uh, the buy and sell uh, ratios here to calculate whether you can do that, how much it's going to cost you and so on and so forth. So how much is one Ethereum worth? How much is one Bitcoin worth? And so on. Uh, solar is part of solar gifts. I'll be, I'm not going to be touching that yet. You can purchase gifts with this internal coin. Uh, you cannot purchase it on an exchange or whatever. This is simply um, as the solar gift shop of Amir Capital. And these are the points that you sort of accumulate and you can use to purchase certain cool things like new phones and, you know, Dyson vacuum cleaners and much, much, much more. Anyways, uh, so we've transferred funds, let's say, into USDT. We've transferred, let's say, $1,000, right? So we transferred 1,000 USDT into here. Now we want to put that money to work, right? We want to make, we want to get 4.5 to 6% monthly passive income. Uh, given to us on weekly payments. So around 1, 1.5% 1 a week. Um, that's how the Amir Capital platform works. So we transferred $1,000. It will be here. And you will see that uh, in the operations history, you will see that you have received $1,000 into your wallet. Now we want to transfer it into a funded account. Obviously, I have zero on my wallet. I'm going to put $1,000, press transfer, and make sure it's in a funded account. That means savings account. OK, in a funded account is a savings account. You can also send this money to another user by email, by phone number, or you can just convert it, your thousand USDT into either Ethereum or Bitcoin right here. So let's transfer. We've transferred the thousand dollars. Press transfer. This money is then um, sent to our savings account on Amir Capital. We will see a thousand dollars shown here. And from here on out, you will be receiving four point five to six percent average month uh, average monthly income sometimes more but most of the, most of the time it's held above four percent four point five percent you will be receiving payments every single week 
So let's say we received, we've put in a thousand dollars and the weekly income of the platform is 1% for, for the users, right? So we've received a passive income of 1%, which is uh, $10, $10, right? $10. So if you put in a thousand dollars weekly, you could expect more than $10 uh, passive income, not too much, but it's still great. So once we've received $10, we can also pick whether we want to reinvest this amount or we want to uh, we want it to drop the passive income to our wallet system. Now, let me get into a little bit of more detail on that. So we've put a thousand dollars in, uh, we've got our $10 monthly income. Uh, we can set it up so that we don't touch this amount and the money that you make gets reinvested on a weekly basis. So instead of a thousand dollars, you will have a thousand ten. Then the next week you will have a thousand twenty, thirty, forty, and it will grow, uh, through compound interest, or we can set it up through here so that your, for example, USDT accruals will go 100% to your wallet. So instead of being reinvested, they're gonna be dropping to your wallet or you can choose to reinvest them completely. It's completely up to you. Um, for more info on that, you can contact me directly, I'll explain. But if you want to withdraw your money through an exchange every single week, you wanna put it to your wallet like I have here. Uh, let's get back to the savings account. Uh, so we have got an hour, uh, we have set it up so that everything falls to our wallet. We have received $10 here, passive income. Um, and we are happy where we've received some money. We can now withdraw. Now, in order to withdraw, uh, we pick whatever we're withdrawing. If we've put, um, if we've put in our savings account, Ethereum, we're going to be getting our income in Ethereum. If we put in Bitcoin, we're going to be getting our income in Bitcoin, which is actually great because if you purchase Ethereum or Bitcoin, um, other than USDT, USDT is a stable coin. It never changes. It's always going to be equivalent to the dollar. Uh, we will actually be receiving, uh, I like to say, free Ethereum and three Bitcoin. So we're basically mining ourselves free uh, crypto. If you buy Ethereum and place it in your savings account, you will be able to get your passive income in either Ethereum, Bitcoin, whatever you choose. Uh, for this example, we're using USDT. I'll get more into that uh, in detail on that later on. So we received our $10. Uh, we choose, obviously, we want to have a bigger passive income to withdraw so that we save money on commission. Now we choose the blockchain ERC20. Uh, you want to enter the address of the exchange that you're using. So you want to drop the money back to your exchange in order to put money on the platform. We needed the address of the platform. Now we need the address of the exchange USDT, which you can find uh, where whatever exchange you are using. We enter that here, whatever it is. Uh, we place the amount. Let's say we've made, okay, not 10, let's say $100 we have on our wallet. We want to withdraw. Um, so there's going to be a commission fee, uh, which is not too big, to be honest. Uh, let's say we put, okay, we don't have sufficient funds now, but it, last time I withdrew, I believe 150 bucks, it was, uh, I think about, it took a couple minutes and I picked the fast option. So as you can see here, now the fee is only $3. And if we go for the slower options, only $2. So it's completely up to you. The reason that Amir Capital has done this is because that more and more users are, are using it at a given point in time. For example, on Monday, uh, 7 p.m. Moscow time, you can expect to get your income on Amir Capital every single week. Um, and a lot of people start withdrawing at the same time, which means that the commission is going to be higher uh, and it's going to take a little bit longer if you go for the slower options. Now, once you've picked your commission structure, you bring it out and that's it. Uh, you just wait. Uh, we can see here our requests. Well, once you have, once you're withdrawing anything from your wallet, you will have a request here. As soon as that disappears, that means the money has gone through. So here we would have had a thousand dollars USDT uh, from here, from Amir Capital USDT wallet to uh, our, let's say, Binance USDT wallet. So that is a sort of overview of how the wallet system works. Obviously, uh, there are. I basically covered about 95% of what you need to know in terms of starting out and starting to, you know, make money and creating a passive income for yourself. I will be going into some detail in the later videos, uh, what a stable account, a stable plus account is for whoever's interested. But I do urge you to contact me personally and or whoever 
put, uh, who showed you the platform, who knows how exchanges work, uh, in order to show you how to get your money onto the platform. For for the West, it's it's very uh, for the Western for Western countries, the EU, for example, Binance is great, which again you can access through my site here and follow the links. All right. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next video.